Welcome back to another day in the life. Today is Thursday. I have a different schedule for every week. So on the plan today, we're going to go finalize the landscaping plan. We're going to 84 lumber so we can finalize the materials for the A-frame cabin that we're going to be building at Insel Acres. And then we're going to go to the bank so we can start working on financing a construction loan for the A-frame cabin, again, at Insel Acres. I'm going to give you a mini tour of Insel Acres. I've been getting a lot of requests for that. And then we're going to end the day at my oldest son's open house. Welcome, let's get started. ready to go i am wearing jeans today because i'm going to be running around and i'm not go doing like really any office stuff so i can wear jeans for the day let's get going all right so before we get started for the day my first meeting is at 11 a.m and so i'm going to use this time to record a video that i already recorded guys so i had to come back to my home studio because the lighting went crazy i recorded the whole unboxing i came back i looked through the footage it looks awful so i got done recording i recorded two videos that was fun now i'm heading over to the site it's 10 45 I'm meeting with my project manager and landscape architect. We should have started on some of the landscaping in May as soon as the brick was completed. But my landscape company has been so backed up, they haven't done anything. So I brought a jacket because it's cloudy and it's actually a little bit chilly. So I'm putting my jacket on and now I am walking into the house. Everyone is already here. Uh, landscape architect got, just got here while, right out as I was um, pulling in. So I'm going to do that. I need to leave here at exactly 11.30. It's 11.45 now, 11.47 maybe. Um, I need to leave here at exactly 11.30, drive 45, 50 minutes up for my next meeting. And there's a mini update. Look at the garages were completed. That's my dog's shower. By three feet high. Okay. okay. In here, you're doing everything. Okay. That look pretty, but I am a little bit. I want to make sure the towel it shows it has like this huge uh, vein. Mm -hmm. I want to try to make sure that they try to match the veins so it looks good. I gotcha. I gotcha. I am so happy there's so much progress at the site we have people working everywhere we have people working on the outside we have people on the top floor we have people on the main floor we have people in the basement it is exciting before i got in the car i got a call my baby girl is in the hospital she's my niece she's gonna be having the baby soon she's pregnant she's been in the hospital for a little bit so now we're gonna go up there i wanted to just go straight to the hospital but i know that when you get induced it doesn't work until in like four hours so i'm just going to proceed and go do my meeting i'm probably not gonna do the tour because i'm not gonna have the time and then i will come back and go straight to the hospital one of the things that i do whenever i'm driving is i'll call my sister i'll call my friends <laughs> And most of the times I'll do work calls but because Thursdays are like my days to to do all the other projects I'm working on you know my house stuff the um, Insel Acres the cabin that I'm building the new businesses that I'm working on YouTube these are the days that I record I'll get the videos ready work on thumbnails you know I'll talk to my mom I'll talk to everybody so I'm going up to Grove City and it's going to be like an hour uh, yeah like a little less than an hour drive so i took the escalade today i love taking the escalade because i can turn on super cruise which is like this super cool feature this green 
means that it is driving it's it's auto driving it is so cool when i know i'm gonna be up here for a while i will um i'll turn this on and then i can be driving for you know i can chill and be on my calls i just have to watch the road but i'm not actually driving so i think that's great actually And they're gonna send you pictures back. Okay. This is way before anything even gets moving forward. Right. You're gonna have a picture on this piece of paper that shows that wall. Okay. It's gonna show your big door. So I'll meet you at your office? Yeah, you just go follow me. All right, let's go. We just met with 84 Lumber, um, and then we met with Anderson Windows to verify all the window sizes and everything they're going to cut drill them i'll probably i'm going to now start the playlist for the a-frame um so once those come out i'm going to do a video about that and then i'll go through the plans with you guys i ordered food i ate some fries i didn't even you know finish eating i got it i got nuggets so we are here at my contractor's office this is the guy that's going to be building our a-frame he has a team of omish guys so it's kind of sad because i'm not going to be able to record the entire um process because the omish you know they don't do cameras and stuff but i'm here now we're going to be meeting with the plumber guy and you know i wish i could bring you guys in these meetings they're actually really fun but i don't want to be like you know sunny signing all sorts of paperwork with everyone to be okay to you know show them on my cameras and then i want to build this as an outdoor entertaining area it's gonna look so cool so we just got done got all the paperwork i came back with now i'm gonna drive over to the land which is not far from here this is our garage this is where we're going to be keeping our equipment we're getting concrete for this um on monday so they were here prepping for that. I'm going to drive down and then I'll stop by the house. Then I'll go to the open house. So I will go home and maybe pick up some, like a change of clothes or something. Then I'll go to the hospital and wait for the baby. <coughs> down hi buddy hi hi taxi so i decided to stop by the house first it is five or six i was downstairs for a little bit with the kids and stuff so now i'm gonna get a change of clothes a few extra things i'm gonna go to the house and see all that they did today i hope they're still there usually they work late so i've decided to change into this comfy um kind of like sweatpants but they're kind of fluffy they're actually very comfortable so i'm gonna keep the top very business like it looks like and then be comfortable on the bottom i am at the house and there's still like one two three Four trucks here are working. I'm excited. Let's go inside and see what they've done so far. Oh, actually, you know what? Let's start with this back side because whenever I left, those guys for the ceiling were working. Let me see how much they were able to get done today. And then the drywall guys are still in there. We started mudding today. I'm, I don't know. I'm so happy. Um, I love when they're working here. I love when there's progress. It's someday. Oh, this looks so good. Okay, let me first turn this around. Let me turn this around for you guys. Oh, this looks so good. I don't think you guys can see it, but it rained, so it is all muddy here. So I need to find, I need to walk through where my shoes are not gonna get muddy. Oh my goodness, this looks, this looks 
so so good there's only a little bit left can you guys see how we stain this black but you can kind of see the grain in some of the some of the buds do you see how nice it looks with the brick and then the black windows that that gray uh beam over there that's gonna get painted black i just think it looks really nice the, the contrast with the black and the brick that we chose it's just so pretty and then they close these doors i don't know if i'll be able to open them from here so it looks like i'm probably gonna have to go and go through the garage but this okay this is only my second vlog but i am loving all the progress today so you guys can see what's happening with the house and come with me for the day and if i wasn't vlogging today it would have been i would have just been excited by myself so now i get to be excited with you guys so this is my garage we have a five car garage and then we're putting another three car garage over here so we're gonna have a total of eight car garage this two car garage is going to be mine and that i'm getting a lamborghini urus once our house is done i i wanted it for my birthday this year but i don't have anywhere to park it the moment my house is done i'm getting a lambo urus and then i have my range rover that was my dream car like it's in my dream car i'm never selling that car so those two will be able to fit in this two car garage so this will be my garage for my personal cars and my husband's garages and then the three car garage will be where we'll park the family car in and then we'll have a golf simulator in there anyway now let's go into the house oh this is so exciting wow oh my 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 kitchen my kitchen is done the pantry is done this looks amazing. Oh my god. Oh my god. This looks so good. And then the dining room. I shot this in last week's video. If this video goes live, it will be last week's video. But wow. This is awesome. This is so awesome. This is so exciting. I I am so happy today. Uh, there's someone working everywhere. I'm not even complaining. I'm just happy that they, you know everywhere I'm going to get some you know space for people. I'm not in someone's way or people can hear me. There's someone working. So hello. <laughs> I had to end that clip there because um, there's someone working everywhere. I, I am. No, I, it brings me so much joy because this house has taken a long time. We are just at the halfway mark. Drywall is the halfway mark of construction, and we just hit the halfway mark right at one year when we broke ground. We broke ground on September 18th, and I believe today's like September 22nd or 23rd. So I'm just so happy to have like this much action happening today and so we're gonna go to my son's school and then we're going to leave and we're going to downtown pittsburgh to the hospital to see my baby girl in my culture my sister's child is my child so my niece in the hospital she calls me mom so i am her mom and whenever she has this baby i am technically going to be a grandma at 31 years old holy f so uh i'm like excited but i'm like now I'm gonna be called grandma. Like, uh. Anyway, let's go to the hospital. Okay, I'm here where I'm supposed to be, but I'm still enjoying my song. 90% um, of the time I'm in my car, I'm either on the phone or I'm dancing. I love music. I love my music so much. I spent so much money on. I don't know, I spent like six figures on speakers in my house in like landscape. That's that's how much I love and enjoy my music. It's the only way that I relax. Um, you know, I'm not the type that will go and sit on the beach and like, you know, read a book or whatever. I'm a very high energy person. So for me, the only way I relax is if I'm dancing, even when I go on vacation. Like for me, vacation is not good if I'm not like partying or like active and dancing. Actually, the only activity I do is dancing. You won't find me running. That's not my thing. If I feel like I want to do exercise, I will, you know, I'll like a Zumba or I'll, I'll just play music and dance. So, 
but yeah i uh, i need to finish my song and then i'm gonna go in because I, I even have a couple minutes into the point, uh, open house so let me finish my song and then let's go we left open house it's 7 30 p.m i actually left a little bit early and uh, now we're at starbucks to get a drink we're heading to the hospital now and the light is bad so i will see you at the hospital we are in the hospital we should i think it's like 10 30 or 11 and we should have baby hopefully tonight so there's no sleep tonight and if baby comes tonight, it will still kind of count as today. So it will kind of count as a vlog. Maybe you can get to meet baby. But yeah, we are here. She's doing well. She got the epidural. So now she's actually enjoying life. I would like to meet the person that invented the epidural. That is like the, the most genius invention in the world. If those that have had kids and have had the epidural, you know, I'm into that. So for now, this is going to be the outro. If baby comes tonight, I will do another outro so you guys can meet baby. All right, bye guys. <laughs>